It could have gone uh, a thousand horrible ways, and I just felt like there was divine intervention on my. I really do. A Little Rock woman counting her blessings tonight after walking away from an accident with just a few scratches. Thanks for joining us at 10, everyone. I'm Bob Clausen. And I'm Ashley Ketz. While driving home on Cantrell, a deer jumped into her passenger window. Our Haley Brooks has been following this story. Haley, how big was this deer? The deer was only a spike, but he was more than 100 pounds, and he caused a lot of damage. I never saw it coming. Deborah Waterford dressed up for Halloween, feeling a lot more thankful as she goes to spend time with friends. I felt very fortunate I wasn't in my little tiny Miata because I think it would have killed me. I really do. Waterford was driving home on Cantrell when a deer hit her large truck. My first thought was that there was a bomb and it exploded, and but it was the deer. <laughs> Only the head and neck of the deer came through the window. I believe that had its legs not been caught on the exterior, uh, that it would have been in my lap, and, and it would have been bad. With the body stuck on the outside of the truck, it ripped off the door handle and broke the side mirror. After calling police and Arkansas Game and Fish, Waterford hauled the deer into the truck and took it to her brother. I just think it's a it's humane thing to do. I mean, the, the you know, it's... um. You know, my brother's a hunter, and if you if you are a hunter, uh, you realize you know how valuable the meat is. Since the accident, Waterford is trying to get the word out about the lack of deer crossing signs on Cantrell and warn drivers to be on the lookout. Recent reports show animal collisions rise significantly in the fall when deer are mating. So slow down, buckle up, and always assume there's more than one deer. Back to you. All right, Haley, thanks very much. And according to the annual deer study done by State Farm Insurance, Arkansans have a 1 in 106 chance of hitting a deer on the road. And here's a map of all of their findings, courtesy of Consumer Reports. The states highlighted there in green are the most high risk, and that includes Arkansas. West Virginia drivers have the highest chance, while those in Hawaii have the lowest chance of hitting a deer.